Hi, this is Kalpana here. In this video, we are going to solve the given differential equation. Let's get going. Problem: Solve dy by dx plus y secant x equals to tan x. Solution: Given differential equation. dy by dx plus y secant x equals to tan x, which is a standard form of linear equation, right? The coefficient of dy by dx is 1 and you have some p into y, which is equals to q. We know that the standard form of linear equation is linear equation in y is dy by dx plus p into y equals to q. Right. Coefficient of dy by dx is 1 p into y equals to q. So we can say that by comparing these two, we can say that the given equation is a linear equation in y okay and we'll get p and q by comparing these two equations that is a given equation with the standard form where p equals to secant x and q equals to tan x right which are functions of x now we need to find the integrating factor we know that integrating factor of linear equation is given by e power integral p dx. Okay? For a linear equation in y. So now let's find the integrating factor to the given equation. If equals to e power integral p dx e power integral for p equals to secant x dx. Since we know that integral secant x dx equals to log mod secant x plus tan x plus integral constant c is equal to e power integral secant x dx is log more secant x plus tan x. Since we know that e power log some function of x equals to function of x, then this becomes e power log some function of x. Again, you can write this as e power log secant x plus tan x. Now, apply this, then you'll get function of x. Since e power log function of x is equal to function of x. So, our integrating factor is secant x plus tan x. Therefore, integrating factor equals to secant x plus tan x. Now, we need to find the general solution to the given equation. Since we know that the general solution of linear equation in y which is in this form is given by y into integrating factor in equals to integral q into integrating factor into dx plus c okay the general solution of The given equation is
y into integrating factor secant x plus tan x equals to integral q into integrating factor. This is our q, right? This is our p and tan x is our q. q into integrating factor secant x plus tan x into dx plus c. into dx plus c then y times secant x plus tan x equals to integral tan x secant x or secant x tan x into dx plus integral tan x into tan x, tan square x dx, tan square x dx plus integral constant c. Since we know that integral secant x tan x dx is equal to secant x n. We know that 1 plus tan square theta equals to secant square theta. From this we will get tan square theta equals to, take this 1 to RHS, it becomes secant square theta minus 1. Now we can replace secant square x by sec, sorry, tan square x by secant square x minus 1. Okay, then you will get integral secant square x dx minus integral dx okay and also we know that integral secant square x dx equals to tan x okay fine now we can write this as y times secant x plus tan x equals to integral secant x tan x dx plus replace tan square x by secant square x minus 1. Okay. Plus integral replace tan square x by secant square x minus 1. Since tan square theta equals to secant square theta minus 1 into dx plus c. Then y times secant x plus tan x equals to integral secant x tan x into dx plus integral secant square x dx minus integral 1 dx plus c. is equals to you can write integral 1 dx as integral dx okay integral secant x tan x dx is secant x plus integral secant square x dx is tan x minus integral dx is x plus integral constant c therefore y times secant x plus tan x equals to secant x plus tan x minus x plus c is the required general solution. So this completes the problem. So we have seen a problem from linear equation in this video. Hope you will understand. We will see you in the next video. Until then, bye bye.